explain how the city is celebrating the Ridgeview fly through as we work our way down the I-17. We'll say on making sure all these pieces work. Nice fresh snow falling in Flagstaff. Zero tolerance. <laughs> right. Hi, everybody. From the cavernous right. Greenhouse. Morning, Chris. Okay, uh, other... Big day, a judge declares a mistrial in the first-degree murder trial of Jonathan Duty. He's the man accused of killing nine people at a Buddhist temple in the far West Valley 22 years ago. Now, the jury had been deliberating for about a month now, and they simply could not reach a verdict. Mia Garcia spoke with one of the jurors today. She's got the details. Mia. The vote was split 11 to 1. 11 guilty, one not guilty. The jury tried really hard to wrap this case. After all, the murders happened in 1991, and in 1994, duty was convicted. Now, fast forward to 2010, when a judge overturned his conviction, and today, his second trial ended in a mistrial. Cleared as suspects after DNA evidence was found belonging to an unknown man. Yeah, and John Ramsey and his attorneys, they fought to keep these papers from being released. Well, it failed. Mm -hmm. You know, this case has been, what now, 17 years ago, yeah. and it still is fresh in so many of our minds, and many people still have an opinion on this. Many people have uh, strong opinions mm -hmm. on this case from our Facebook uh, page. Georgia Taylor English says, I think they need to ask the son Burke more questions. They, the Ramsey, shuffled him out of the house before anyone could question him right mm. after it happened. Seems odd, she says. That's a good point. Yeah. Okay, uh, other people that are chiming in. Jeanette uh, Ralia says, let her rest. Wow, what a day. Sky Fox capturing a wild police chase that lasted for more than an hour. This was quite a scene around town. And it finally ended when the driver blew through a red light at 7th Avenue in Maryland. It was the second accident caused by the driver who turned out to be a woman. Touching or dancing with your buttocks. Touching. It says that. Or in the air. You can't have your said, buttocks in the air. No kidding. That's what the contract says. I'm reading <laughs> wow, it. Wow, you can't yeah. put your butt in the air anymore? I didn't write this. Really? I'm telling you about the story. <laughs> I don't know. You think that's going to... Well, it's, uh, well, maybe you don't keep them from doing it. didn't say anything about alcohol consumption or anything. There, that's yeah. okay. It's just no twerking. It is at your bed. <laughs> wow. It's Friday. Good morning. Thanks for waking up with us. Yeah, right. a lot of schools are implementing this sort of a twerk-free environment, a zero tolerance. <laughs> right. Putting up the signs out in front it's about a, a block away as you approach the school. <laughs> Picture of the big <laughs> Sorry. Overshare. Sorry. <laughs> Save us, Carl. She's a drink. We were sorry, so sorry. close, Ron. I know. Sorry. No, no. <laughs> hey, look at your day. Beautiful. You're going to love these numbers. Uh, hazy sunshine out there. And uh, boy, the Alpo people are not going to be happy. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> yeah. Thunderbird High School Spirit Day, where students were encouraged to dress up. They picked up a, a Cowboys versus Indians theme because the school's mascot, the Chiefs, right? Mm -hmm. So the students. Good morning. The stu Hey, good morning. All right, so we're going to get right into uh, this Kimye news. They're engaged. We heard about that. But somebody of the valley. A quick fly through as we work our way down the I-17. If that's your freeway of choice this morning, from Peoria to the stack, we're under 10 minutes, 8 minutes to be exact. If you're traveling the I-10 out of the West Valley at 51st Avenue, you can see right now uh, that the traffic out there is light and quiet. No accidents and plenty. McCloskey in HD. Hi, everybody. From the cavernous, beautiful, lovely, high-tech. Yes, it is high-tech. Well, is. there's a lot of commotion going on in the studio. Can you hear all the I noise? I can hear it. Can you hear everybody uh, like, uh, joking and laughing and That everything? means one thing. That means that the, the uh, Suns dancers are here. And it's Friday dance break and, time. And you, could, you could hear Celeste in the background, you know, chirping yeah. it off and everything. Go on, Celeste. Okay, right. what are we doing here? We are going to dance to Selena Gomez, Slow Down. Hit it! 40-year ban on ice cream trucks. And Ty Brennan is live tonight to explain how the city is celebrating the return of the ice cream trucks. I'm sure the kids are celebrating. Yes, yeah, some are excited, others not so excited. Nobody at the city exactly knows why ice cream trucks were banned more than 40 years ago. 32% of workers surveyed say they're calling out sick when they're healthy, and 30% are going to work when they're sick. Harry. <laughs> Uncle Harry. Harry with clothes on. Yes, okay, <laughs> as and, opposed uh, to his Vegas, <laughs> his Vegas trips right. that we know him for. <laughs> One oh, last this is picture. a good picture, Harry. This is sweet, isn't it? Yeah, yeah the Royals, of course, with the middle this is uh, Here the, so the health insurance marketplace is open. The website's up. The bright, smiling face inviting you to come in and sign on. 
Jeff Moriarty is our social media manager, and he knows a lot about computer stuff. Why has this rollout been such a mess? Well, even though this looks really simple on the surface, behind the scenes, this is an incredibly complex program. So first, they had to do it in a very short period of time. It's a night of comedy on Fox 10 starting at 7. You can catch brand new episodes of Dads, followed by New Girl and The Mindy Project, and then stick around for Fox 10 News at 9. Fox 10 News is back. This is a great shot, isn't it? 18-foot oar fish caught off the coast of San Diego all the way down. And this is actually bigger than what we're showing it to you because look how small the people are. So it's probably almost double this.